Hey guys, it's Peggy here with Citrus Templates and I just wanted to show you this cool thing that I have been playing around with uh, this week about creating seller landing pages in Canva. So I had this idea, you know, a couple days ago and I was just like, oh, I wonder how I can do this in Canva. Well, I figured it out, so I just wanted to show you how you can do it. And this is completely free. So you don't have to, you know, subscribe to a, you know, any services to get these seller landing pages, but you can essentially do this uh, for free using uh, two softwares. For, so first we're gonna use Canva, and the second one is the form, which we're gonna use Jotform. Uh, so Jotform, it's free for I think up to 10 submissions per month. So if you need more than that, that you may have to pay a fee, but if you don't, and you know, 10 is pretty good per month, then you can probably just stay on the uh, free um, um, plan. So what we're gonna do here is create something that looks like this, where it's uh, it's basically a seller landing page. Like you can share this with, um, you know, on social media, you can share, you know, maybe a QR code to this, uh, to this uh, website. And it just all it asks is one thing, right? You, you're, you're telling the, the seller one thing, I'm getting my home value. So what is your Green Acres uh, home worth? And then they're going to fill out the form and then you're going to get the form and, uh, you know, follow up with them accordingly. So this is really just for lead generation of seller leads. Sellers love to find out their home value. So this is a great kind of lead generation form. Um, you know, I would put this in places like where you're, you know, talking about maybe a specific neighborhood. Um, the beauty of this is you can, you know, update this for different neighborhoods neighborhoods and have different um, different websites uh, for different neighborhoods. So let's dive into the details and see how we can create this. Um, so the first thing to do is um, you can you can just create a I think this is the website uh, template. So you just go go on here. Um, you can you can do uh, different designs and, and things like that. So uh, let me just go home so I can just show you how to do this like literally from scratch. Um, so the first thing to do is you can, you, you know, you're on your Canva home and then you can go down to the website. Let me just see if I can find it here. Uh, so website. So now we're creating a completely new website. And um, what I would do is, you know, you can uh, figure out your background. Um, so I have the pro version. So I, you know, you can choose different photos. You can feel free to like pick your own photo. Maybe you have a listing photo. Or what would be really great is if you had a photo of that neighborhood, like that specific neighborhood, um, and you're asking, you know, what is your Green Acres, you know, home worth, and you have a, a photo uh, in the background of that neighborhood. So that makes it even more attractive because that seller knows, oh, that is my neighborhood. Like this person is legit and, you know, knows, uh, you know, my neighborhood versus a generic photo. So I would do, I would do something like that. Um, I made this uh, just a little bit darker so some of the other stuff stands out. Um, here and then um, you know then you can add in your heading so you can just add in here you know what is your home worth um, your green acres home worth right and then feel free to you know play around with the colors and all of that I like using these marks so that I can figure out where where the middle is um, we can change the color here like that. Okay. Okay. Now the next thing that you want to do is then now we have to add in our, um, uh, add in, you know, the form, right? So what you want to do is go to apps and then we're going to choose embed. Um, so let's see if we can find it here embeds. So that's the next thing to do. Then you're going to like paste a web link here. So that's that's what we're going to do next. Now I want to jump over to Jotform uh, because I've just created this simple form and you can uh, copy this form. I'll show you how to do that as well and I'll leave a link uh, below to the form. It's super simple. Basically, the first part is, you know, they enter in their address, then they just click next, then they enter in their name, and then their email. Um, so you can, my recommendation, you know, you can do either email or phone, phone number. Um, 
probably phone number would be maybe better just because, um, you know, then you can just call them. Like as soon as this lead comes in, then my recommendation is then you call them immediately and say, hey, I saw you're interested in your home value. Uh, I'm working on that for you right now. Is there anything about the house that I should know so that I can give you the most accurate value? Like, is it uh, like, have you made updates to it? Like, what's the condition? You know, so you're really just trying to start a conversation with the seller on, you know, how to get give them the most accurate value for their home value. And then obviously, at the same time, you're trying to figure out, are you looking to sell? Are you just like curious about your home value? Right? You're just trying to figure out like how you can best help them um, by, you know, through giving them this, this home value. Okay. So, so that's a simple form. Again, you can substitute this for a phone number. Um, I would probably do either email or phone. You don't want it to get too long, uh, but pretty much their address, their name, and their phone number. And um, how I've done this is that this is a blank canvas on the back. Um, so you can, um, you know, you can change this um, for however, however you might want. Uh, but this works really well for inserting it into, you know, the Canva template. And then some of the other settings here, um, you can you can have these email responders. So so once somebody something comes in, then you're gonna get an email, obviously that says, hey, somebody submitted your form. Uh, and, but then you can also, if you have email, have an autoresponder here, and you can edit this as well. So uh, so the person who's submitting, right, they submit their email address. Now they're automatically gonna get an email uh, from JotForm that just says, thank you for requesting your home value. Uh, you know, we're working on. On it, um, you know, please give us the most accurate, you know, give us uh, any updates that you've made to the property. So again, you're, um, you know, trying to start that conversation uh, with, uh, with the seller. So feel free to update this as, as necessary. Okay. So, so once you have that set, then now you can go to publish. Right. And so here's the link, right? This is the, this is the link that, um, that you can use to, uh, to insert into uh, Canva. So we're going to take this link and uh, we are gonna go to here and then we're back at our Canvas site and we're gonna paste this and add it to the design. Okay, so now it is right in here. Uh, again, because I made the background transparent, it just comes through as the form. And, um, you know, you can adjust it, you know, you, and the thing I like about this is like, you can pretty much, you know, just drag and drop and design your website, right, without needing to know like anything technical about like WordPress or anything like that. Um, so you can just drop the form in, um, you know, figure out what you want to write here, your background, design it however you want. Um, and then, and then that, then you just have the form in here. Um, and then the next thing to do is simply just go to publish your website. Um, and, and then you can use, um, the free domain. If you just want to publish it on a Canva domain, you know, Canva has all these other options. You can purchase one or you can use an existing domain. So, um, so do whatever you need to do here. I'm just going to do it for the free domain right now. And you can go to continue. And so now you have a, uh, now you have the URL, right? So this is, um, you know, my site, citrustemplates.my.canva.site. And then you can, you can, um, you know, have that thing there. So you can change this part of it. Um, you know, maybe you want to say Green Acres home value or whatever, uh, or make it shorter or something like that. But you can change that if, if you wanted to. So I'm just going to keep it like that for now. And then I'll show you how this works. So now we've got that, and then actually I'm gonna, let's load it up here, oops, let's see. Oh, we have to publish it. So let me publish that. So, let's wait for that to prepare. Now we can view the website. Okay, and so you can see now that it has come up and it now you anybody who comes to this website can see, you know, what is your Green Acres home worth now they can add in, you know, their their address and everything. I'll just do let's see, let's see, 123 Main Street, um, you know, sometimes this this um, goes will become bigger, but you can also also just put it back into the normal normal site. Uh, let's see, we'll just do Honolulu, Hawaii, and then 98765. We'll just say that, okay? And then that's me. And I'll do search this. 
So they just go through and they submit the form here and then it'll just say, thank you, we'll be in touch with your home value. And then you'll get an email saying that somebody had submitted their form. So this is, I think, just a simple way to get a seller landing page, right, that you can design on your own. You know, if uh, you want my recommendation again, like as I'm doing this is I would probably put, you know, your, um, you know, definitely put your, you know, contact information here, put your photo here, something. But the very, the only thing that they should be doing on this site is um is going is submitting their their contact information so uh, you can create this website uh, pretty easily uh, again i'll i'll show you how you can you can actually clone this form uh so let me let me show you how you can do that as well um i will copy this okay so i'm going to copy this then i'm going to go to create form import form then uh, go to from a web page and then you'll just have that form and then create the form and then it'll import into your account so you can take this form edit it however you want and then put it into you know your canva design and that is how you get a seller landing page for free um, using you know canva and jot form so if you guys have any questions feel free to reach out uh, uh, citrus templates is here to be your go-to resource for all real estate systems so definitely check out some of our other products and our free resources uh, that you can download from our website and I will see you in the next video.